Hello friends, welcome to Geeks for Geeks YouTube channel. In this video, we'll solve one more tricky C question. Hope you're excited. So let's get started. In the previous video, we have solved a same question related to printf, and we came to know that printf will return the number of characters that has been passed. So that is printf of in printf of hello, five characters would be returned by printf as it is an integer type function. So i value would be five here. Print hello five. This will be printed followed by five. So using the same concept here. So print uh, we have taken int x x equal to printf of percentile d comma printf of hello. So in printf function again we are able to take printf of printf one more printf. Why? Because this printf would return five because hello contains five characters. So that will be assigned to this five percentile d. So the same way. Uh, so this is nothing but printf of percentile d five. Instead of five, what I am doing? I am taking printf of hello. Okay. So after that, what again I am doing? I want to print this x value. What this outermost printf function is going to return? That would be the x value that I am printing in the next statement. So like this, you can take any number of printf functions separated by comma. But consider only. Uh, but the final output would be final return type of the printf function would be whatever the, uh, the characters that has been placed in the first double. So you are here. You are having only uh, percentile d. That means percentile d will be replaced by five. So the final value as this printf is going to return 5 so percentile d would return 5 okay so how many characters we have taken only one character so the final x value would be 1 it is not 5 because here we have here percentile d is returning only one value if it is 100 it will be return three values okay so the final of uh, value of x is 1 would be 1 here not 5 consider the characters that would be placed the first double code of the printed uh, printf function so output would be hello phi 1 why hello phi because the evaluation of this printf function uh, no matter any function evaluation would be take place from right to left not from uh, left so if you evaluate from right to left what will happen first this would be evaluated hello would be evaluated so hello would be printed then out uh, percentile d would be printed percentile d would be printed that means hello phi followed by one. Hope you understand why you why you get one here because percentile d is returning percentile d returning only one value that is five one character and don't consider the second printf function so, uh, final value will not be five here only first expression double code what are the values that has been placed in the first expression double quotes you must be considered that's it friends thank you for watching the video I'm pretty sure that you would have enjoyed this video so please like it share it with your friends and do subscribe to Geeks for channel regular updates like this. Thanks for being with us. Have a great day.